family I'm popping on camera just to talk to you about my hair I got a special request to do videos about hair products and so I decided that I was going to show you rather than just tell you what I'm using since today is the day I happen to be coloring my hair it's a snow day it's like a good time to do it so here I am and forgive me I just I have no makeup I have nothing on my face I'm just all natural here at home today because it's just me and the kids and hubby and my mom is here so we're just trying to relax and stay out of the snow so the product I've been using to color my hair for about 20 years is called Bigen or Begin. I'm, I'm not sure exactly how to pronounce it, but I've been using it for a very long time. This color is black brown and it's the number 58. And then what you get inside the box is a the dye itself comes in this little bottle and you get a measuring cup because you can use this for a half, a quarter, or a full head. And the good thing about that is if you just need to retouch, you can always just retouch and only use a portion of it. Oops, sorry. And then also in there comes gloves. I don't use these because I find these too big, but I do keep them because you can use these for other purposes like cleaning around the house or if you want to put them in your cleaning caddy or if you want to um, use them in other areas, by all means keep them. Uh, I also am using my Ion Cup. I got this from Sally's Beauty Supply free with a purchase as well as this brush. And I'm using from the dollar store these bags, plastic bags for processing. I'm also going to use one when I deep condition, which brings me to the next part of this video, or part of this segment, so to speak, is what I'm going to put together to make my um, deep conditioner. So what I'm going to use is my Trader Joe's Nourishing Conditioner, and I'm also going to use with that the Shea Moisture Raw Shea Butter Extra Moisture Detangler with sea kelp and argan oil. I'm also going to mix in my Trader Joe's Coconut Oil. And I'm gonna mix in this L'Oreal Extraordinary Oil Complex Renourish Mask, like this, and it's for curly hair, it's in their curls line. And I'm gonna mix those things together as my deep conditioner, put a cap on, and I'll walk around the house with a, you know, hoping to generate some heat from my scalp to kind of get that moving. I'll rinse that out, and then I'm going to let my hair air dry. I will corn roll it and try to get it prepared because my plan is to wear a wig for the next several weeks because I'm I'm basically gonna protect a style for the winter I just am because there's no way I'm gonna be able to stop my hair from dealing with friction against clothing and all of that because my hair has grown to this length where it's like right up my shoulders and it's just the ends will rub if I don't do something so the plan is to probably do that and then after a couple of weeks I'll check it to see if it needs to be my ends need to be trimmed or whatever the case may be so that is what I'm working on. Those are the products I'm using. I'm not sponsored by anyone. These are all purchased products, but I wanted to share with you because it was a special request. But I plan on still putting in some more clips for this video so you can see kind of the way the rest of our Saturday goes. But yeah, that's about it. But thanks for watching, and if you want to see more, stay tuned. Hey guys, I'm so sorry I didn't get a chance to shoot the end of my vlog from Saturday. Um, not a whole lot happened and then I ended up having a family emergency earlier in the week and so that kind of put a damper on things but just to let you know, today is Wednesday. I just left work and I wanted to go ahead and end the vlog because it just kind of ends with me talking about my hair. So I did color my hair, I did cornrow it, and I have a um, this half wig on. This is the same half wig from my haul. You can see it's pretty long, but I like it. And I have a hat on right now, but all I did was leave the front of my own hair out. It looked better earlier, but I've been at work, so it's a little bit weird. But anyway, all I did was lightly flat iron the front of my hair to blend. 
so the color is very close I don't know if you can see that but I'm in a dark kind of area of course at the mall I'm always at the mall so yeah that's about it so put God at the head of all you do and I'll see you guys in the next video